name is Stephen Harrell from Tiny House Listings, and today I thought I'd bring you guys along. I'm building a door for a super small cabin. Uh, the door is only 23 inches wide and about 7 feet tall. So it's a really small door. It's going to be custom. And I think it's going to look cool when we're all done. I uh, thought it would be something you ought to be interested in, so stay tuned. First things first, the piece of plywood that we're using here is actually construction grade plywood. It's 3 quarter inch. And what construction grade means for those who don't know is just that it's kind of rough stuff. It's got a lot of knots. It's not the most beautiful in the world, but this is going to serve as the back side of the door. And um, this, this part will actually be exposed, one of the sides, but it's going to get two or three coats of paint, so you really won't see it. And the cabin that this is going in is really rustic. It's a low-cost kind of sleeper cabin. Uh, but if you're going to build this for your tiny house, a door, uh, the way that we're building in this video, you'd probably go and get you some really nice stuff, like maybe marine-grade plywood. It's like 80 bucks a sheet, but it looks really good. All right, so what we're going to do now is trim out the edges of the door. This is going to be the front side of the door, and we're using 1x4s to trim out the door uh, for this particular build. You don't necessarily have to do, use 1x4s for your door, but that's what we're using in this one. Okay, we got the door trimmed out. The next thing we're going to start doing is putting in the center, which is going to be tongue and groove, pine. Uh, we're not going to put in a window in this door because the wall that sits right next to uh, this door is actually going to have a built-in window, but you could easily put one in yourself. All right, we got the front and the sides painted. Now we're gonna let that dry and flip it around and do the back. All right, we're back out here a few days later, painting the back side of the door. It's Christmas day, beautiful, sunny and 60. All right, we got the back side painted. So the next step is to take this out on the property where this will actually be installed. See you there. And there's the door. It's on a four by 16 foot cabin that we're out here building in the woods. Uh, it's just a matter of hanging it up with a couple hinges then putting some backstop behind it. Real, real simple project. Uh, total project cost was about 50 bucks. Um, let's see, what else can I tell you? Uh, yeah, and then the next thing to do is put a deadbolt on it, and then we're gonna get an old school doorknob, maybe like skeleton key style, just to make it kind of funky. So it's something you can definitely build yourself, especially if it's you're doing like a rustic type setup. So anyways, thanks for watching. See you on the next video.